yeah, I just click stop and start after the video. Good kitten internet. Um, I believe the kitten is, yes, at my feet. Although he just moved. Where we last left off, Yang has money. We want money. I like money. Um, we have a pact with Miriam. Miriam has 160 energy, so it's not too bad at least. Uh, apparently, we're both at war with Yang, so that's good to know. Um, where would I want Miriam to fight at? I don't know. I am very tempted to give Miriam the um, two former Spartan territories. Although those are still really nice locations. But I'm losing over 30% of my energy. That one's even worse. <clears throat> I want Lol out of my territory, but I have a hunch that if I told Lol to get out, he actually did. Okay. I was not expecting that. All right. Let's go ahead and give Miriam these two spots then. No, no. I need to move my unit out first. Because otherwise I'd lose the chopper and I don't want to do that I just upgraded it that's a locust of Chiron those are invasion forces complete actually that might have been a battery also it attacked and failed not too surprising you have a lot of drones can I do anything about that yes you don't have a research hospital which also means that you do not have Nano hospital. What else do you need? Um, oh, you're probably on coastal now that I'm thinking about that. Coast two. Um, let's make sure you're doing the research hospital first, though. Because I don't think another base on that island is going to help. Or live center, you have finished your hybrid forest. I want you... You actually do need the Coast 2. Except you have a hybrid forest, so let's delete that. Production complete. Terraform complete. Going to stay. going to road even more things because you must road all the things apparently numb let's get some more money we need money oh yeah speaking of let's take a look at the invasion situation um they barely even injured me <laughs> okay it's more annoying that they got rid of my request confirmation honestly i think I'm going to have a unit there by the time it matters. I hate eating two retool penalties, but that's my own fault. Um, speaking of having a unit. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I want to be able to make it. Hold. Forest. Hold. Old. Oh yeah, I wanted to see what unit type that was. That is artillery. All right. That's fine, I guess. You. Um. Honestly, we should be going Dakagoma Rock over here. Come on. There we go. Yes, lol? Uh, okay. I don't know what lol wanted. Actually, it went too far. Oh, well. Hold. Heal. Indigenous life. Nom. Indigenous life. 
his life force. Pink, apparently. Get eight minerals. <sighs> More food spots for the lack of anything that I'm doing with them. I should probably do something about that. Let's agitate some over here. Um, you really should not have that with fungus. You're gonna forest. Improvement oh, already. I apparently have a mag tube there. Whoops. Okay, you actually finished healing, so let's Indigenous life form. apparently go to town. Did we actually capture an entire stack? No, we just captured a mind worm. Or a uh, other not mind worm brain does not want to work. Um, I love the deep. Yeah, I'm still gonna remove the fungus. Let's agitate some more. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Bot recovered. Bot recovered. Okay. Um. Sorry to run out of things to do on that island. Yeah, go ahead and heal in that spot. Oh, I hit go to instead of forest. Whoops. You need to start the Great Migration down. Or over. 27, so you're going to be one turn off. Oh, 25, there we go. You're only going to take one damage then. Turn complete. All right. Is it worth t sending Sparta Command and Halls of Discipline under their control? I don't know. If I do one, I should do the other. Those are still really good spots, but ugh, that inefficiency. And, yep, it is all drones now. I think it probably is a good idea to give it to them. Sparta Command and Halls of Discipline. Also discipline. There we go. Although, damn, do they have a drone problem. Why do they have so many drones? What the hell? Okay. I don't get it. I mean, they're starving because of other reasons, but... I don't even have the tech to increase. Oh, that's why. They are... Wait, they have a police problem? Oh, right, they're running free market for some dumb reason. Whatever. I can always take it back for them later. <sighs> really like to have fewer clouds. That would be nice. Maximum population reached. You're using missiles against Isles of Deep. Okay, whatever. Universal translator time. And the Lord said, Behold, the people is one, and they have all one language, and this they begin to do. And now nothing will be restrained from them which they have imagined to do. Go to, let us go down and there confound their language, that they may not understand one another's speech. 
All right. So we immediately gain two techs, and we can now cash in any number of alien artifacts in um, that was Academic Rock. So tech time, which also out, gives us a tech. The hourglass of temporality, when the noise of secular life has grown silent and its restless or ineffectual activism has come to an end, when everything around you is still, as it is in eternity, then eternity asks you and every individual in these millions and millions about only one thing, whether you have lived in despair or not. Soren Kierkegaard the sickness unto death. Data links. A lot of philosophy in this game. What can I say? Um. So yeah. We have discovered a second set of secrets. This is not normally the second set that I discover next, but that's fine. Alright. Let's go with Nano Mini. We're probably going to end up doing both of these, but... Objects once measured in meters have become so small that they cannot be seen by the naked eye with revolutionary applications across the board. Gentlemen, forget what your courtesans have told you. Size does matter. CEO Nwabuda K. Morgan, mm. Morgan Industries Annual Report. Damn it, Morgan. So yeah, we have Nano Mini, which one of the things it gives us is a hover tank, which is our most recent chassis upgrade. Um, it Hover tanks are basically the better version of rivers. That's it. Also, we have algorithmic enhancements, which make probe teams even better. Speaking of, we should probably be using more probe teams. Um, industrial nanorobotics probably does make sense. Already we have turned all of our critical industries, all of our material resources over to these things. things. <laughs> these lumps of silver and paste we call nanorobots. And now we propose to teach them intelligence? What, pray tell, will we do when these little homunculi awaken one day and announce that they have no further need of us? <laughs> Sister Miriam Godwinson, we must dissent. So you will start noticing that a lot of Miriam's quotes at this point of the game are very, um, revolutionary in concept um she is definitely having problems with the idea and her place in the universe and we'll eventually run out of quotes we'll just put it that way um so yeah industrial nanorobots which comes from nano mini yep okay um i guess we're going to be doing a run toward high-end tech because that's what's next Okay, this is our best productivity base, if I remember right. So we should... Robotic assembly. Robotic assembly plans for reference is increasing minerals by 50%. And it's cumulative. We should probably build Jean Jack first. And, oh boy, are we going to start hitting our clean mineral limit again in this base. I bet you. Production complete. Yep, this is the base that I'm worried about. No, no more food. Uh, actually, if we pick up three more food, like so, it will stop growing. And we're going to do that until it's done with the network node. So I'm actually going to remove the tree farm as a result. My gift to industry is the genetically engineered worker, or Jin Jack, Jin Jack, specially designed for labor. The Jin Jack's muscles and nerves are ideal for his task, and the cerebral cortex has been atrophied so that he can desire nothing except to perform his duties. Tyranny, you say? How can you tyrannize someone who cannot feel pain? Chairman Shen Jiang, SS, on mind and the matter. Yeah. Yang is not a nice person. Um. This is a reference to Brave New World for reference. Um. And we're going to see a lot more of those. So yeah, we have built a gene jack. And we finally have eco damage. It appears as though our clean mineral limit is probably 55. 
Um, yep, yeah, 55's our claimed mineral limit. So that's good to know. So we do have Aging Jack, which means our psych profile gets a little weird. And unmodified, we are solid drones now. It'll get worse. Because you can get something worse than drones. The game never tells you about it, but it does exist. Um, Nano Factory probably makes the most sense. Let's get, reduce our upgrade costs as much as possible. Complete. Yes, I know you're going to be drone rioting. That's my fault because I removed your garrison. Request confirmation. Just finish Production that off, please. Complete. But I need to kill this thing before bad things happen. Thank you. Uh, let's go down there. Forest. We're eventually getting up to the top. Bot recovered. I said, what are you doing? Silly kitty. Let's get another tech. As I stepped onto the mag tube, a thought struck me. Can there be friction where there is no substance? And can substance be tricked into hiding from itself? Dr. Gail Nambala, Morgan Industries researcher. So yeah, um, friction's totally not a thing that you need, right? Yeah, surfaces that are remain unaffected by friction. Uh, yeah, so cloaking devices. If you are playing a multiplayer game, a cloaking device would be extremely useful. It allows a unit to avoid detection by enemy units unless if they actually try to enter the same square. Um, they also ignore enemy zones of control so they can move across where units are. This is a thing from older Civ games for reference. Um, that second part still works, but the first part's useless because the AI knows where every unit is in the game. And it doesn't take much for a player to figure it out either. So it's a useless power. We're going to stay put. All right. You have colony pod. Where am I going to put this? Probably over here. Yeah. There. I can't build colony pot colonies on fungus, by the way. That's not a thing that you can do. All right. Bonk, bonk, bonk. So I use Alpha Centauri as a game to relax. It's part of the reason why I tend to get so addicted to it is because it's a very relaxing game for me. It's not a relaxing game for a lot of other people, but I played so much of this when I've been unemployed at various points in my life or on break from college or just needing a break in college or anything like that. So it's been nice to be able to come back to this, but I know that I can't keep doing this because I will keep doing it. Um, road, road, really wish I knew why there was a rooster crowing constantly. All right, we have our first set of mag tube constructed. Um, mag tubes, for reference, do not appear to change any part of the um, production of a tile. All it is for is for movement. So I tend to build roads almost everywhere, which also don't change um, production on a tile. And then mag tubes specifically between locations that I want connected. Sometimes I will go overboard and start mag tubing an entire island, but I don't 
that's not actually all that good of an idea in general. Numb. Indigenous life forms. But recovered. Any supply. Um, yeah, you're going to undo some fungus. We're going to sit there for a turn so I don't die. Um, you are going to head back. Toward here. Borehole. Invalid terraform oh. command. Not borehole that spot, so I'm gonna mine it. Um Covered. Network or alien artifact. I did it again. Uh, and we're starting. Yes, Isun. I know, but it's not time for you to eat. It's getting closer, but it's not actually time. Um, what am I doing with this unit? Um, I don't even know what the difference is between those. How about we look? Because I should upgrade it a little bit better than that. Also, we finally have money. So, uh, that should upgrade. Sure, to a skimship. Why not? We're going to do Plasma Shard. Deep Sea Radar because it's free. And... Honestly, I would like to do Empath Song. But Marine Detachment. There we go. We are going to Yarhar the crap out of this. That's still 90, that's 100, that's 100, that's 130. Yeah, res 8 costs a lot. So we are going to do that. And then we are going to upgrade the unit. Wherever it went. And I accidentally made another unit in here. It's that one. There we go. One unit. And you're going to go play around with Yang. Yang is over in this area. Right? Um, Yang is over here. I am the, I am about as far away from Yang as I can get. So this... Darn it, I miss the days where you can zoom in with the mouse cursor, that was so much easier. It's really far away. Turn complete. But we will have to make do. We're at 23 minutes. The game is going so slow now, Maximum my apologies. Reached. Now the Gene Jack Factory. Reached. Yep, we have drones. And we have seven eco damage now. How about that Centauri Preserve? Let's start increasing our clean mineral limit again. Production complete. Terraform complete. Yeah, we can undo some of this fungus among us. Terraform complete. Right. Um, you don't have a road there. Let's build one. Okay. Let's see. I mean, we've mostly covered this area. I'm just going to be building extra boreholes and stuff like that at this point. All right, we are going to move this hulk of a unit. Uh, the first drop-off note, we actually have stuff there. Um, 
Oh, we're going to wait one more turn because it's not fully healed. Indigenous life. Oh crap. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I should not have messed around with trying to get units when there's a colony pod there. That was my mistake. Hopefully the colony pod will live. That's going to suck if it doesn't. Bonk, bonk, bonk. We are no longer particularly in the business of writing software to perform specific tasks. We now teach the software how to learn, and in the primary bonding process, it molds itself around the task to be performed. The feedback loop never really ends, so a tenth-year polysentience can be a priceless jewel or a psychotic wreck. But it is the primary bonding, the childhood if you will, that has the most far-reaching repercussions. Vedal Ron, Wakener, Morgan Polysoft. So yeah, um, so digital sentience, yeah, we are just making AI at this point, you know, as you do. Um, there's a couple of things that this gets us. First off is the network backbone, which is plus one research at this base for every point of commerce the base receives, and plus one research for every network node in existence on Alpha Centauri. That is a huge amount of bonus research potentially also it eliminates the negative effects of a cybernetic society which we just gained as well speaking of um we'll, we'll take a look at that in a moment cybernetic society is a plus two efficiency plus two planet plus two research minus three police that minus three police would be horrible for us right now we are not going to do this but i just wanted to point it out um it would get us to plus seven paradigm economy which would be really nice um, but we can't afford the effective minus five police. So we're going to keep, st stick with thought control until we at least finish building the, um, whatchamacallit, um, secret project that eliminates the negative effects. Yeah, we're not researching anything. Invalid terraform uh, command. Um, all right. Um, so sentient ecometrics which give us Paradise Gardens. Paradise Gardens, fun fact, you cannot build a Paradise Garden and a Punishment Sphere in the same location. Paradise Gardens just give plus two talents, which is really nice. Quantum Power is tier three reactors. Normally, I don't even have tier three reactors before I get tier four reactors. So that's interesting to see this early. Um, the Self-Aware Machines, that give us two different, uh, which we call it, um, secret projects. The NetHack Terminus, which is the opposite of the Hunter-Seeker algorithm, where it gives all of your probe teams the algorithmic enhancement. And the Self-Aware Colony. The Self-Aware Colony, I believe, re does cost reduction on base maintenance. In addition, we have Orbital Defense Pods, which are missile defense, and Nessius Mining Stations, which is plus one mineral in all bases. It's the mining version of the satellites. Um, the Nessius Mining Station will also increase clean minerals by one every time, the problem is that plus one mineral in a base, if you have certain types of buildings, give you more than one mineral. So we have to watch out when it comes to the mining stations that we don't max things out. And finally, we still have the probability mechanics. Um, I think I'm going to go with sentient uh, econometrics. And it's time to switch back to... Labs. We're down to three turns per tech. By Glenor. Ooh, we're at two talents per. It's because we actually have enough psych just on a new base. Neat. This is Coastal One. Indigenous 
life forms. Indigenous life forms. Um, get us even more money. We're going to start rushing some secret projects momentarily. Really wish I can tell GoTo to stop interrupting movement when you go nearby non allied units. Indigenous life forms. So that's what it's doing. And it's annoying. Alright. That is 11 away, so we're going to move there. Indigenous life forms. Alright. everything all right let's actually get this taken care of nope oh, I for some reason I thought I had one more movement whoops oh well uh flat rainy I want to make sure that there was no more units hiding around. Indigenous life of course it was. There. Now this can go back to the way it was. Turn right. complete. Right. We have made it through another turn. Oh, I forgot to hurry up things. Uh, we have Alpha Centauri B reaching Perhelion. So all native life forms increase in level by one. That's actually what it does, and they become more common. The game holds. I lost my empath or impact or infantry, unfortunately. But we finished the living refinery. Let's go. We estimate that during the next mission century, most of planet's industries will be moved off planet to Nessus Prime and other orbital facilities. Many of our industries will benefit greatly from the low gravity environments available in space, particularly those involving genetically engineered microbes. CEO Mwabudike Morgan, the Centauri Monopoly. I'm still trying to figure out that the implication of that is that it's a genetically engineered machine. Anyway, we have plus two support now, which is nice. So we've got that going for us. Yep, time for more Gene Jack. Production complete. You finished up that really fast. Um, we're at Coast 2 already over here. And, oh, this doesn't have any hab. Delete all items out of queue. Hab. We'll do hab first. It's probably all safe to start having begun. that. Oh, crap. We're going to sit in there because we lost our garrison. Um, we're also going to build a garrison. <laughs> How far are we from any blue anyway? We're pretty far from blue. Required ability. Mm. 
Yes, you are going to raise up that terrain. That way this becomes... So these tiles will end up being land, but more importantly, there'll still be a waterway there and this will become land. That's what I would like to have. So Terraform complete. I am intending to keep that territory. Uh, why the heck did I build a farm there? No. <laughs> that might have been AI stupidity. Condenser. Sleep. 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 Academic rock, please. Indigenous life form. Really, you don't need any formers. You need tree farms. Y'all need tree farms. All right, we've got another sea colony. Where do I want to put this one? Yep, you can see where we started building more colonies at and we slowed down again. So we're trying to speed things up again so we can build more colonies. Rinse, repeat, forever. You can also just barely tell that we've been making sure that the believers have been going up in power. They're actually last still, but you know, better. Um, here actually is a good spot. It's nearby an existing colony or two or three. Uh, honestly, I don't actually care about Dream Twister. There's much better things that I care about. Um, we're going to switch Project this over to initiated. Nano Factory, I think. So yeah, units can be up repaired quickly and completely, even when not in base squares. And the cost to upgrade units is reduced by 50%, which is very nice. Um, what is our base with the best... Okay, Gagarin Memorial Commerce Rating is a plus 15, which is pretty good. University Base, it is plus 13. Okay. Uh, Tchaikovsky Institute, it's... Okay, yeah. Our Commerce Rating is definitely best in Gagarin Memorial. Request confirmation. Tempted to just pay for all of it. Let's get that a little more optimized. Um, where is that unit that just got canceled? Activate unit. Oh, for minerals. Try to speed things along a little bit and just spend all of it. We have plenty of money. Okay. Now that you are completely healed, where are we going to start dotting places for colonies? We should probably have a colony over here before somebody decides to go plunk down one of their own. I would not put it past lol at all. Uh, if I was going to do that, I'd probably put it here or that's all fungus is the problem and that's not that great of a spot it's not the worst that would be better but there's fungus there um i'm gonna want a colony over here so that's one two admittedly actually that spot's not bad so yeah let's go ahead and have it move this way so if we're having it move this way where can I plop down a colony in the mean meantime? Oh, and there's another colony thing. 
board the next transport. Activate. You're going to have a lot of units on. Yeah, you have six cargo right now. Sleep. That rooster's going to drive me up the wall. I'm glad that you all can't hear it. At least I don't think you can hear it. I don't know because a lot of these videos have been recorded in the same day. <laughs> so who knows if you can hear it or not. Rocky, arid. You're going to be flattened and then forested. You still have stuff over toward the right. I mean, I have bases over there, but I can still go collect things. Oh. Ooh, evenly matched. Can I win? No. Let's not do that. That's dumb. Pod recovered. Um... Lots and lots of forest. Turn complete. Forest all the things. All right, let's start trying to speed things up. Uh, Nano factory can also be sped up. Do I want it to be sped up? Probably. So it was working on Dream Twister, and I don't really care about the Dream Twister. I care about the Nano factory. I also care about the Follows Mutagen a bit, but uh, don't I have that being produced somewhere else? I don't. I have the Nana Factory being produced in two different spots. Whoops. Project initiated. All right, so Nana Factory. Request confirmation. Yeah, just spend all of it. It's fine. And we'll have you do that for a bit. Uh, Fireless Mutagen. Request confirmation. You're expensive. Um, minus 57 times 4. 57 times 4, that's 207 times 4. 7 times 4 is 28. So 228 off of the price, which means 900... 900 minus 24, which is 876. Yay. We're going to have a lot of secret projects, by the way, because we have three of them ending this turn. Yep, that'll be fine for now. So prepare for lots of secret project movies this turn. Keep sitting really tall. Actually, I should just raise that up a bit. Now I can sit tall. There we go. Follow Smoochin, I think. The Earth is the cradle of the mind, but one cannot stay in the cradle forever. Konstantin Tsiolkovsky, the father of rocketry. Data links. No, nope, it's theory of everything. Okay. I've been mispronouncing it. It's not Tchaikovsky Center, it's Tsiolkovsky, as in the rocketry person. I should know better. I've watched lots of Planet ES, the anime. The fungus has been on its dominant life form since about the time of the lower Paleozoic on Earth. But when once every hundred million years or so, the neural net at last achieves the critical mass necessary to become sentient, the final metamorphosis kills off most of the other life on the planet. It is possible that we humans can help to break this tragic cycle. 
Lady Deidre Sky, Planet Dreams. And now you're starting to see what happens to the planet. So effectively, planet, every so often, every like hundreds of thousands of years or millions of years or something like that, will end up reaching a point of actually reaching full on sapience, except that it causes a mass die off of all life forms on the planet. And since the planet itself, the life on said planet is what's causing it to become sapient, that don't work. So the plot of this game is to allow the planet to truly achieve sapience, or as the progenitor race puts it, achieve flowering. So yeah, we have plot. Also, there's a lot here, so pause if you want to read through. Then paging down a bit. All right. And we have more secrets to do. So that's what we're doing. Although Eudaimonea. Mmm, Eudaimonea. Oh, Production. secrets are better. Industrial grade nano paste, planet's most valuable commodity, can also be one of its most dangerous. Simply pour out several canisters, slide in a programming transponder, and step well away while the stuff cooks. In under an hour, the Nano will use available materials to assemble a small factory, a hover tank, or enough impact rifles to equip a regiment. Colonel Corazon Santiago, Planet, a survivalist, survivalist guide. guide. What's weird is that this is an out of place quote. The reason why I say that is that we haven't had a quote from Santiago in a long time now. It's because they're Santiago it doesn't exist. And I don't just mean in this game, but in the plot of the game, Santiago got wiped out early. Um, you'll see lots of references to Sparta Command and so on. That's a guy in base, plot-wise. So, yep. Anyway. Golden Age, begun. Uh... But yeah, we can build Paradise Gardens, which do exactly what it says on the tin. It's extra talents. Um, extra talents are good, so there's not much of a reason not to build it. We do have eco-damage problems again, which sucks. Complete. We're going to have to deal with that. And there's not really a great way of dealing with that with us right now. Uh, the Fileless Mutagen is going to help a little bit. Project Speaking complete. of... We welcome you, Earth Deidre and Earth Weed and Earth Tree, as honored guests. For you add great power to our ancient song. Planet Fungus and Planet Worm and Planet Mine, sing and play here, and you are welcome among us. Lady Deidre Sky, Conversations with Planet. Yep. a nice quote so yeah um that should reduce the effect of industry so hopefully we have more free minerals maximum population hoping reached. so we're going to double check that last base that we were in um we're going to go ahead and throw down a paradise garden as well maximum population reached the inventory is finished so now we can load we do have hab here right no we don't that's right i stopped it from doing hab um, that was not lab three. It was Ven Svenny. Yep, we're eco damage zero again. So that's good to see. Um, what is our clean mineral limit now? Because academic rock is eco damage 23, and I'm about to make it ridiculous. This is not necessarily a good thing. Maybe I should stop doing that. Um, so that reduces minerals by nine it reduces eco damage by 11 the heck So, clean mineral limit appears to be 60 right now. 
So why is eco damage not adding up properly? It should be. I don't know why it isn't. Hmm. A little concerning. Um, like I said, should probably not have the robotic assembly plant. As much as I would like to have even more production in here, we're doing way too much eco damage. We need to stop that. Um, Dream Twister. Project initiated. We don't have enough money for it yet, but we will soon enough. All right. So clean mineral limit appears to be 60. I really wish the game would tell you. Yeah, this base has 60, for instance, and it's fine. Uh, so. Yep, if I went to 61, I have four eco damage. So, yes. Oh, I know why. It's because I only have plus one planet. Because I'm not running a cybernetic right now. Although I can now, right? Uh, no. No. What was the tech that I need to not... The secret project that I need to not have bad things happen? Is it Network Backbone? I don't think it is. Yeah, it is. Okay. That explains it. Um. So, yeah. You are... You actually do not have much in the way of minerals anymore, do you? That's a problem. We're going to need to shove a lot of money at this base in order to be able to afford it. And it's going to take a while. Energy. We're not even at a... Th we barely have a third of the money that we need at the moment. So that's not the greatest. Terraform okay. Uh, no, I did not actually mean to attack that. You're going to sleep for a turn. Even a forest. Uh, I should have told it to do two land instead of two sea. Pod recovered. Sonar pod. Don't really care. It's been a while since I've actually heard from any of the AIs, which is a little creepy. Pod uh, recovered. Xenophungal bloom. Don't care. I mean, Xenofungus is Xenofungus. It's, at this point, it's still 2 one, one. It's not that bad. Improvement already exists. You're going to mirror. Life. Numb. Numb. Bonk. Numb. There. Now we don't have that stupid problem that I caused. There. We might as well just forest that now because it's going to need to be forested anyway. Speaking of foresting. Um. Uh... All right, you've got eight movement. probably not too far off of no longer wanting to remove fungus. Oh, hello, Deidre. Uh, no, I'm not giving you Centauri Sai. Would you like to be packed, brethren? We are now packed, brethren. Sweet. That works. I didn't particularly want to fight Deidre? Although you have 12 eco damage in your capital. Wait, that means your clean mineral limit's four? No, that's not right. You're definitely doing more eco damage than your mineral limit. Um, yeah, it's somewhere above 10. It's probably 12, would be my guess. Huh. 
Anyway, continue on. They're allies now. You don't have to worry about stopping for them. Honestly, I'm just going to leave that fungus there. Oh, where do I need to... Oh, right. I'm going to have new bases over here. Let's just start moving you where it's going to need to be. You can go to Baikonur. Who's going to be population six by the time it gets an infantry. Life forms. Mine. Ah, yes, I do actually have mine forms on that one. Good. I needed somebody to go grab land pods. Terraform complete. Okay. Um. Turn complete. Next turn will be last turn. Whoa. Okay, so this is a very interesting event. So you can have a random event that a volcano appears. In this case, it actually appeared on the upper part of the map. That's not normal at all. But the weird thing about that event is that it's actually possible for it to appear on any tile on the map, which includes your bases. And if it appears under a base, that base is destroyed. There's nothing you can do about it. It can only happen once per game, as far as I know. Who knows, it might be able to happen more than once, but I'm pretty sure it's just once. And yeah. Okay. Never seen it happen on the polar ice cap before, though. That is definitely weird. Destroy them. Yes. Reached. Terraform the whole game briefly halting things getting a little annoying. Terraform complete. Great, we have our tubes to Academagorok. And now we're going to tube down Terraform to lab three. Complete. Indigenous life. Nom. Bonk. Bonk. Um, annoy. Where are you going to go? I think I want you down. Down here, actually. Indigenous life form. Sleep. You'll notice that we're producing colony pods and the population's not going down. That's because it increases every turn. So it produces and then it takes into account population, which is hilarious because that means that city will never grow. Uh, like, even if I had removed hab limits entirely, it would still not grow. But we don't need it to grow. Let's see if we can take it on. Yes. Give me that money. Indigenous life form. More money. Bonk. 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 Might as well investigate this new scary land. So weird that that happened at the top. What the? Uh, that must be like the world wrap point or something. Um... Solar road. Yep, that's another landformer. That's fine. Okay, you are completely healed. I 
That probably is the closest point down here, isn't it? 27. I'd take two sets of damage in order to reach it. Not great. I really need a spot in between. I assume this is more. It's actually the same 27, which means that this might be closer. Activate. Yeah, it's actually closer. It's doable. Game. Okay, so I need to go down to Zabunai Free Base. We need to go to the free base. Got it. Um, I have 13 fuel. That takes 19. We're just going to fly direct and take damage. See, we don't get to interact with those, unfortunately. Life forms. Well, we got one big happy family worth of cargo here. Uh, you can go automate. Yep, see, I had mentioned before about the whole if you automate or if you have an AI do it in some manner, they can throw a sensor on top of fungus in the water when you can't do that normally. It's just a thing, as you do. connect all of our cities up. Bot recovered. And an artifact. Um, go ahead and throw down a mindworm there. Turn complete. All right, and we're at an hour, so I'm going to go ahead and stop this here. Hope you've enjoyed this internet, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!